Stephen Flynn. Yeah. 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 Mr Speaker, wholesale, wholesale gas prices have fallen by 75% since their peak. Yet in just a matter of weeks, the British government, the Westminster government, intends to increase energy bills by a further £500. What would motivate a Prime Minister to do such a thing? Yeah. Yeah. Well, Prime Minister. Mr. Mr Speaker, what we are doing is providing tens of billions of pounds of support for people with their energy bills, particularly the most vulnerable. What we're also doing, uh, opposed by the SNP, is to invest in producing more homegrown gas here in the UK and the North Sea. But I would say to the Honourable Gentleman, as one of his own, I, I saw, one of his own Members of Parliament said this week, that if the SNP were a pizza company, their products would be slow, wrong and costly. <laughs> I would say to him, it's time to focus on the issues that matter to the people of Scotland, and producing more energy is absolutely one of them. Stephen Flynn. I'm not sure that inferring that energy bills, Mr Speaker, don't matter to the people of Scotland is a winning strategy for this Prime Minister. But let's get real. The fact that wholesale gas prices have fallen by 75 per cent means a windfall to the Prime Minister and the Chancellor of around £15 billion. So what they're saying, as it stands, is that they intend to raid the pockets of ordinary Scots whilst lining the pockets of Westminster. Mr Speaker, it's time to set aside. It is time to set aside any notion of an energy price increase to instead protect households and perhaps reduce bills by £500. Does he not agree? Mr Speaker, we're saving households across the United Kingdom, including in Scotland, £900 with our energy bills as a result of our energy bill guarantee. And in the coming years, we will spend £12 billion protecting particularly the most vulnerable families, pensioners across the United Kingdom. But the best way... The best way to reduce people's bills is to halve inflation, as we have promised to do, and it is to produce more homegrown energy here in the United Kingdom. That's something that this government supports. Maybe he could confirm whether the SNP supports that. Mr Speaker, the Prime Minister was well aware of the dogged campaign of the Honourable Member for North West Norfolk for 